Hello everyone, so you recently became a patron and I appreciate that immensely. Let's get you up and running. The first thing that you need to do is log in at vttassets.com, head over my homepage and log in with a Gmail account of your choice. The second thing is, you will now go over to the user menu over here to the top right, your name is displayed then, and you hit my patron. This brings you up to a screen that allows to connect both accounts, your Gmail account with your Patreon account. So let's click over here and let's say, okay, VTT assets allow you to connect. So patreon.com is, is a, that's a redirect to patreon.com and he asks, do you want to connect with VTT assets? And yes, we want to do that. And the page reloads once and then I get the information from Patreon about are you a Patreon or not? We are seeing here that I've successfully connected both accounts, but bummer, unfortunately, I haven't found any records of you being an active supporter of my campaign. And it might be, especially at the beginning of the month, Patreon updates are coming in rather slowly. So it might take a couple of days, unfortunately, one to three days at the beginning of the month until I've really received the updated information of you being a patron of mine and I cannot do like increase the speed of that. If you're pledging in the middle of the month or anything it should be like almost instantly so without worries. Uh, just that you know beginning of the month is always troublesome. So right now we're seeing we are connected but I'm not a patron. Let's see how it should look like uh, because over here I cheated a bit and I support my own campaign now with another account, you should be seeing this image. You, you will be seeing that you are at the healthy t uh, snacks here or a cup of coffee or endless manner, whatever you're pledging to. And this is the first tier that actually unlocks anything. So healthy snacks, endless manner, cup of coffee is a um, token of appreciation. Thank you. But doesn't unlock anything. So let's get that clear. So you connected both accounts. First step. Congratulations, so that's only one little step lying before you. So right now we are seeing, here I'm a, I'm a supporter of the campaign and I already connected uh, to, to Foundry here. So that's up and running. And let's head over, let's close that. We go to the extension now and we hit the options page here. And now we can see, let's log out here. This is the screen that you will be receiving. Per default, it, the extension is running in basic mode. And in order to unlock it, we use the same Gmail account that we used on VTD assets to log in. So let's do that. And what is happening behind the scenes? The extension is submitting, hey, I've got VTD assets at gmail.com. Is he a Patreon or not? And the backend looks into the database and says yes or no. Okay, and in this, part here it says okay he's a patron patron mode unlocked and that means we can go to D, &D beyond and uh, D, D beyond and we go to whatever monster we want to import and it's unlocked so that's what you want to do uh, let's check that for a bit let's go to a source from Baldur's Gate and the little chicken mm, amazing so you can see no error messages. I can import that okay. And we see the abyssal chicken fiend over here. Wow, what a nice guy. So I hope that little quick tutorial helps you to get started and happy importing. Enjoy the show.